so much. We're all blessed, every one of us here. We'd like to invite you to come up to church with us. Uh, we have a good time in the Lord, and uh, we're just so thankful that we can come out. We've got freedom to come out and sing. I've got a lot of lost family, and the uh, Lord knows all about it, and I'm praying. I'm looking for good results, So, but we'll send this out to my Aunt Ruthie and uh, Ada. They're watching, and pay all easy. They watch it, and my husband, he watches the Lord. But pray for us if we want to do what God would have us to do. And I want to encourage the ones that are out there dealing with sickness to just do what the Bible says. And every word of God's word is true. And um, just a couple of three weeks ago, um, I got a phone call from Michigan saying that my mom had um, been in the hospital very sick. And um, we got up there, and they told us she had fourth-stage cancer. That was on a Friday, and on Monday we had a special prayer meeting for mom. Not a healing service, but just prayer meeting, like the Bible says, where you call upon the elders of the church to anoint her with oil and pray. And um, we all, it was sort of like a mini revival in the church that night. We were there about two and a half hours. But the Lord touched mom in a special way. And on Wednesday, the PET scan um, came back showing everything had shrunk by 50%. And by the end of that week, um, the biggest mass in her lung um, which they said there were several masses in her lung that were cancer, um, but they one the biggest one had already resolved. And so I thank the Lord for that. And if you're out there and you have a sickness, the great physician can heal you if it be his will. And that's what we had prayed for, Lord, if it be your will. And Dad had preached a message that night, Lord, you could if you would. And so I thank God for what he's done for my mom. I'd like to mention Gary and Bob and Madam Ray. They watch this 